Yes, we are roasting The Sims because The Sims really tried to f with the Caliente sisters, and I am not having that. This whole roasting thing started because I was working on our limited pack, limited CC restaurant, but I wanted to do like a celebrity black and white picture autograph wall. But then I was going and taking pictures of Sims. You know, I love taking pictures of Sims. And the Sims are like an abomination. And I understand that they have restrictions as far as like, what's available to them but that does not that does not account for the terrorism that occurred when the sims made the caliente family this should be illegal so in order for us to like understand this best we need to go back in time to the Caliente sisters and the story of the Caliente family, okay? And this is how you'll know just how like truly tragic this is. So the Caliente family started in Sims 2 and there are these two like sexy ass sisters right here, okay? This style of Sim for me was like the hottest Sims 2 Sim you could have. And they have opposite personalities. So that's like the thing, right? Like one of them is shy and serious and neat. And then the other one is playful, outgoing, and a bit sloppy. Okay, so Dina married Michael, but they had no children. And Michael died of old age. Michael's urn sits on the coffee table in their living room. Jesus Christ. Nina has a lover and he is next door. And his name is Don Lothario. But Don is also involved with Dina, apparently without each other's knowledge. So Dina and Nina are both dating Don, okay? But Dina is in love with Mortimer Goth, though it is rumored that she only wants to marry him for his money, okay? 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 We meet the sisters back in Oasis Springs, and this is their household. And it says, it's no longer girls only, now that Caliente matriarch Katrina has moved in her mooching boy toy Don with three fiery attractive ladies in the house, will Don remain faithful or will he get involved with more than one Caliente woman? So we are to believe that Don now is dating their mom. This is toxicity, but that's not like the real reason I want to roast them for you guys. I want you to see these sims. I am to be told that this is Dina Caliente. According to what sources is this Dina Caliente? The thing that like bugs me the most about it is that it could have been so easy for the sims to have given us something something similar let me refer you to this banging fucking dress okay so even like this okay we put her in this slam and jumpsuit but that brings me to her hair why is this her hair color if the game literally comes with this hair color dina was a 10 out of 10 in sims 2 but then we come to Nina. This is where it goes from like a misdemeanor to a full-fledged felony. Who is this for? Who is this for? You can't even tell me that that's like what women were trying to be. Because I was around in 2014 and let me tell you, I never looked like this. Not once. Also, they made her nose much smaller, which is really annoying. Maybe Nina and Dina had glow downs, and that's why Don left them for their mom. No. Why are her eyebrows a different color than her hair? In The Sims 2, this was like as good as it got. You know, there just weren't a lot of options for making attractive male sims in sims 2 who the fuck is this meathead why are we on jersey shore 
And who is this guy? And how has he convinced three related women to fuck him? In Sims 2, he was wearing a button-down collared shirt. And now he's like two steps away from fucking Ed Hardy. Okay. This is gross. You're gross. I love you. Okay. So let's give her some makeup because she's wearing like a nude lip. She really is like super tan, but she has this like awful white blush. I do want to give her like that really amazing plunging neckline that she has. I think that this might be the one. Listen, I know it's extra, but look at her. Look at her in Sims 2. And that's what bothers me about Sims 4. Like, she's a fucking nobody in this game. She's really trying to get to be a bartender. And like, like that's not easy. What the f***? Dina, I'm so sorry they did this to you. Okay, honey. Why not show everyone your boobs? I want to give her something that's like, I'm a gold digger but I'm an advanced gold digger. I'm a successful gold digger. Oh wait, this one. Perfect, okay, just a little like watch because bitch, I got a date to go on. Would she be out here like wearing a tennis skirt though? Do you know what I mean? Is she that bitch? Ooh, this is like preppy and cute as fuck. She wears a whole outfit to the gym. I mean, how else are you gonna find rich athletes? A crime. She changes her part when she goes to party. Disgusting! Caliente. I did not realize that that was the same hair as that. They had us, but I figured them out. I can't believe you've done this. Let's put her in like, like a ski bunny moment. Baby, are you cold? And you're like, yeah, why don't you warm me up, daddy? <laughs> it's time to work on Nina. I'm sorry, I have to fix her face makeup before I can do anything because this is offensive. How am I supposed to make you look approachable when you got your eyebrows looking up like that? Who hurt you? Like, she definitely needs eyeliner. Maybe that's the problem. She just needs, do you think she needs this though? Or is it, am I telling the truth when I say that no one needs this? Okay, yes, honey, I love that for you. Oh. Yes, yeah, Sims 2, she's wearing. Nothing. She's wearing nothing. Halter. I like couldn't even think of a word for it because that's how long it's been since I've said the word halter. Oh, what about this one? She has a slamming body. Oh, these are perfect. These are perfect. When you're mischieving, do you need a lot of arch support? Sims, what have you done to this woman? And why do you hate her? Okay, what if we did like this ping? Yeah, it's like kind of toned down, but also kind of like, I look fucking good. So Nina's like shy, but evil. Why does that remind me of a 40-year-old housewife? Maybe that's it. Maybe she's like trying to be like a desperate housewife or something. I feel like this is like nice and shy. I'm so shy. Here, you have long hair. You have to do updo. You must do updo when you're wearing your tennis outfit. Like, she would steal your man on the tennis court. Hello, sailor? She's going to a party. She's a mischievous bitch. She is a bad bitch. Watch out. She's coming to play pranks on someone. But while you're there, she'll steal your heart. What are, who are you to tell me what necklaces I can go to parties in? Yeah, that's better because of that picture of her. She really is out here just wearing that bikini. It's actually a bra in the game. I don't even think that's the bikini in the game. Oh, we got another one. Good boy. Look at it right here. Oh, you dropped it, buddy. It's right here. Relax. This is offensive to women and humans everywhere. Uh, hashtag Goobs Got Wood one, the number one. And uh, that'll give you like 20% off 
uh, your wood lubricant. So now we have to make their mom. And like the thing that bothers me is that mom stole Don and like looks ridiculous. That is a MILF right there. I would fuck. This is a big boobied mama. And this is a great example of how the game does not know to how to handle physics. Ooh, wait. Okay, I think that this is definitely the way to go for mom. Because I can tell you that I would be worried that my boyfriend would f*** my mom. I mean, this is not a formal outfit at all. This is something else entirely. Mom, why are you wearing that dress? It's embarrassing me. Ha <laughs> ha. You know what a good kit would be? An accessories kit. Earrings, necklaces, rings, nails. My mom. Well, you implied that I was a llama, so how can I ever trust you again? She do be working out. I think she's trying to pick up men probably at the gym. You know, which which legging says, fuck me and give me your wealth? Oh, this is definitely something you wear in between yoga classes. You put on this little cardigan that does fuck what? See, this one has a lot of crotch action, which is why I'm interested in it. Ooh, hello. Hey mom, what are you wearing to the party? Oh, you know, I just threw something on. What are those? They, they are, are my crocs. crocs. Like, who cares if I catch a chill? I might catch me a man. Oh, so she's wants to find a soulmate and she's family oriented. But she's totally f***ing her kid's ex. <laughs> oh, these. Oh, hell yeah. Bad versus bad. Ooh, some fuck me pearls. Hello? Like basically for Don Lothario, I want to bring him back to his like suave ways. I think that Don Lothario has a man bun. Hear me out. That's what I've decided. Although Don Lothario with gauges can f me apart look at that wow holy mother f mr don <whistles> though wait like he totally should wear this though i have a question what are men anyway and where do you get off and fucking how we do that i think that's good oh my fucking god how dare how dare would he be wearing like a full jumpsuit oh yeah yeah, he would. This is amazing. I fucking love it. Oh, absolutely. Danny, my boy, how are you doing? He wear leather pants. Is he like a full Ross Geller moment? I don't know what men look like. I met my husband seven years ago. <laughs> All right, Don, put on your earrings and let's... I feel personally attacked when i look at this don is going swimming and baby you know this boy's wearing a speedo Ooh. Like, i want to put him in these jorts and i'm going to and you can't stop me so we have actually completed <laughs> the entire caliente family overhaul okay let's take a little look so first things first, we've got Mama Caliente, who, may I just say, Caliente is an appropriate adjective here, picking up men at, like, museum functions, you know? In between yoga classes, at the watering cooler. Oops, did I drop my scrunchie around your dick? Ooh, is this yours? I didn't even realize that this was yours. These clothes, they just shrunk in the wash. This is showing off her yoga six pack. Does anybody need some ice cream? And then I'm like actually really into this outfit and I don't know why because I hate every piece of it. And then together I'm like, mama caliente, por favor, mas. This is Dina. Oh, she's outgoing, uh, romantic, and she wants to be a, oh my God, I was gonna say meteorologist, mixologist. Like, hello, invite me to the Grammys. Playing like tennis or some shit. Love it. 
total transformation to go to a party. Takes hours to get ready, but then she walks out of the room and it's straight up, kiss me beneath the man and I I don't know the words. Going to the beach, what? And you know, just walking around in that uh, a little, a little ski bunny moment. Now we go to Nina. She is quieter, but she's also mischievous. So like, she's like a little bit shy, but she's secretly fucking gorgeous. Gorgeous. Super preps. I think that they probably go to like a tennis court and like pick up guys. You know what I mean? You know, just a little something fun. Party? What? Who is this? We don't know. I love this look for her. That dong, do dong, dong, dong. This is such a cute outfit. I love this. I would wear this the second I became comfortable wearing shorts. It's just like chill, you know, like it's more functional. And finally, we have Don. Now remember, Don has been said to have dated both Nina, Dina, and now Katrina. Oh my god, Katrina. So like boy toy, you know? Like are you playing him, Katrina, or is he playing you? Like I don't even know. Take me out on a date. Show me the town. This is so much I can't even deal with it. But I've never seen the back of it and I hate it so much, you know? What up? I'm Jared, I'm 19, and I never fucking learned how to read. Of course. Juan is saying, he's like picking up like a rake and he's like, where does this go? <laughs> and finally, his hot, his cold weather outfit. I planned on getting through multiple families today and then the calientes were so bad that it took that long. Thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight. I had a really good time. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and if you can't get enough, come over to my Twitch channel. I stream four days a week, Sundays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, and I would love to see you there. And until next time, live your best life and be your best self. Bye!